Did not used to be the case, but Knoxville is stepping up in the national concert world. New poll ranking Knoxville as one of the top 50 destinations in the nation for concerts, for live music. Our Kristen Allen looks at why. Lizzo, The Eagles, Shania Twain, Stevie Nicks. No matter your taste in music, there's probably a show you want to see coming to Knoxville. Knoxville's really benefiting now from several decades of a, a, an evolving music scene on all levels. So you've got this uh, ecosystem that's really supportive of live music in general. Knoxville shot to number 41 on Polestar's concert market ranking, up 56 spots from last year's poll. A big contributor to that jump, the sheer amount of concert venues artists have to choose from. Artists look, oh, we're going to, you know, we're going to tour, you know, let's go to Knoxville. We do great business and we've got, there are great places to play. Tom Bug, the general manager of the Bijou and Tennessee Theater, says in addition to great venues, the city's location on the map is a big help. I think Knoxville's location helps a tremendous amount because you've got two major interstates, a north, south, east, west. Knoxville is also evolving in the music festival scene. Big Ears Festival brings nearly 200 performances to downtown Knoxville every spring. The festival's executive director says the music scene here in East Tennessee has changed a lot over the last few years. Now, operating at that level and bringing in shows at that level really helped develop an ecosystem and an audience for, for concerts of all kinds. Visit Knoxville hopes the musical momentum keeps up and continues to bring people from all over to East Tennessee. These are people coming in from other towns to stay in Knoxville and go to these experiences. So that just really gives us a whole nother platform in which to tell the story of why you should visit Knoxville. In Knoxville, Kristen Allen, WVLT News. And just announced this week, rock band Chicago, East Tennessee's Morgan Wallen going to be playing. Here's a closer look at some of the bigger shows coming. The Eagles, Thompson Bowling Arena, April 1st. Second biggest tour in the country right now. Tickets, though, are pay <laughs> they prove that. Starting at 160 bucks. Stevie Nicks, Thompson Bowling Arena, May 16th. Tickets start there for 109 Kiss, the end of the world. Their road tour. End of their, uh, their, their last tour. Lands in Knoxville, November 24th, the day after Thanksgiving. You can find out more information on all these and a lot more. WVLT News app.